Over the years, when we have implemented recycling programs in small offices, to government offices, and sometimes even in unionized facilities, people don't react to change the same way. There are people that we call change agents who are willing to do and, and, and embrace change. And then there's these type of people we call cave people. And cave people, the acronym is C-A-V-E, which represents citizens against virtually everyone. Mm. And when I say that, I mean, even if you were giving out $50 bills, they're suspect. They're going, what's going on here? But what we've seen over the recycling is when we implement a recycling program, people don't believe it. They're the naysayers. They go, I can't make a difference. You know, it's the old mentality of voting. My vote can't make a difference. And what they do is they push back. They don't want to get involved. They put in a grievance for the slightest thing. And we know who these people are because they'd rather complain than help out and assist. And I've seen this many times. And sometimes the way to work through cave people issues is something as simple as have a group of employees, let's say 10, and nine have bought in, but there's always that one holdback. But what we've seen is this is a powerful tool when you just focus on them and say, why aren't you taking part? That's what I've learned because there are some people you just simply can't change and we write that off and move on. But overall, the, the thing is in sustainability, the changes are coming and you have to embrace change because we're all here. Our mission is be part of the solution as opposed to part of the problem. I'm Bruce Buck and encouraging you to never waste a moment even when trying to change people's habits.